Hey guys, in this video I'm going to share just one tip that you can do that will help get your kids involved in dishes, setting the table, and unloading the dishwasher. Seriously, just one really cool modification you can make in your house to help get kids as little as three, four, five, six years old involved in dishes, okay? Stay tuned. Well, welcome back for another Full Joy Mom video. If you are new here, my name is Dawn Marie and I have videos coming to you every Tuesday and Saturday, motivation in your mom life, consistent tools and tips for you to grow your entire house both spiritually and practically. So if you haven't considered subscribing, I would absolutely love for you to do so and let me show you this super easy tip. Are you ready for it? Okay, be ready. So I took all my kids' dishes, this was like years ago, maybe, I was soon after we moved, like maybe three years ago, okay? I took all my kids' dishes from up there where they could not touch them and reach them and I put them down here, okay? It has been the coolest thing that I seriously have like ever done in my mom life. Well, okay, I get a little excited and then I, go overboard in my descriptions. There's probably cooler things than changing dishes, but this right here is, I actually can't even take credit for it. It was the Lord. I was like, Lord, what am I going to do with, we are renting and I have cabinets that I didn't want to um, like screw into. And I'm sure now they probably have devices anyways th that you could, you know, not screw in and keep them closed. When I made this modification, so now everything is, everything is down here, right? He can't, and yes, I'm sitting on the floor, crisscross applesauce whatevs. Okay, so he can now, all of my kids can set the table. Like if they want a snack, they know I can tell them to get their own bowl. Like I, they have been made so much more independent through this one modification because now they can reach everything at their disposal. Like I had an extra divider um, for silverware laying around. So I have straws, all the silverware up top. And then this is like, you wouldn't even need that. You could literally get a box from Aldi or have no box at all and stack them. But it's like this super old um, a, like pampered chef or maybe Tupperware or something bin that has dividers in it and we just chuck them all in there and honestly sometimes it's way messier than this we cleaned it up for you today and then I just I keep some um, of the kids extra travel cups in the back but now I can say go set the table and they can go set the table I can say um, get your snack for your get your own bowl for your snack and they can do that by themselves I can even say uh unload the dishwasher and my son Jackson who is six he started doing it probably at like I don't know maybe four or five years old okay so he will unload the entire dishwasher by himself and he'll put all obviously all this stuff down here and then anything um, I would go in first and I would take all the knives out that are sharp I would remove every sharp knife and then in this drawer here is that's our silverware drawer so he could reach to put the silverware away for the adult silverware and then anything that I was super attached to, like if there was a special mug, I would pull that out beforehand and hang it up too. But then, you know, since he can't, everything else goes up top, right? Boop. So he can't reach that, but he would just stack it all on the counter and then I would come in and put it away. But that has been so much fun for them to get to do. And Fiona wants to show you because now Fiona is four and she, it's her job now to unload the dishwasher and Jackson's been helping with laundry. So she wants to come and show you guys how good she does. I hope this helps. I had to make a modification because I could not. Hello, um, and then I did the knives. That's right. That's right. At six years old, I could trust you to put the knives away because you could reach it. Mm -hmm. He did it for like maybe two months yeah, straight every the single day. The knives are right up here. That's right. I'll show the knives are right up there so he could reach the knives and I could trust him. So one reason that I don't have cups down here other than the travel water bottles, I don't usually get to those. Um, but I don't have the house cups down there because the younger girls were starting. We use a Pro Pure water filter up there, that thing. I love it. I highly recommend it. Um, well, the girls were starting to get their own water, and that was not working out so well. And I will say doing this down here, yeah, kids are probably going to get into it and play with it sometimes. Different ones of my babies have been more interested in making a mess with that than others. But 
It's way better than having like glass things down there that they're going to break or chemicals that they can get into. And since I couldn't modify the cabinets to lock because we are renting, this has worked out great. Oh yeah, one more thing. If you had like little, little ones you wanted to get involved, like maybe a two-year-old or something, you could completely unload the dishwasher so it has nothing inside of it that they can break and only their stuff. And then you could let them come and do it if you were like super interested in doing that. <laughs> so I have no idea whether this tip is actually useful to anybody but us, but I absolutely love it. I think it is so cool. It has helped us so much. So hopefully it helps you too. And I will see you guys Saturday with another video. Have an amazing full joy mom day. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. See ya. Go ahead. Hi guys. My name is Bian. So I know how to end with the dishwasher. And my mom is here watching me and she loves what I see. So I'm going to show you how to unload the dishwasher so all your other kids can know how to learn. She's alright. She's big enough. Careful, extra, extra careful, very careful. You got very extra careful. Hi, I hope to sell. Thanks, guys. <coughs> Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching, guys.